Nerve-wracking day for many. Oh, if you're worrying tonight, I hope you can get some sleep. Good luck. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. At least 100 people are dead after a passenger jet crashes at Madrid airport. The Span Air flight to the Canary Islands crashed on takeoff. There are reports the left side engine was on fire. Tonight, holiday horror in Europe's worst airline accident in years. There were clear skies and good visibility when the plane prepared for takeoff. We'll have the latest from Madrid and we'll be asking what went wrong with flight JK5022. Also on the programme, loophole in the law as Gary Glitter heads for Hong Kong, why he can't be put under Britain's toughest paedophile controls. Throw away Britain, new calls for us to repair clothes and household goods rather than replace them. And lightning bolt, the Jamaican speed king breaks another world record and leaves the rest of the field standing. Good evening. At least 100 people are dead tonight after a passenger jet crashed and burst into flames while trying to take off from Madrid's main airport. The aircraft, operated by Spain's largest, second largest airline, Span Air, was taking passengers to the holiday destination of Gran Canaria in the Canary Islands when it veered off the runway just a few hours ago. Tonight, a major rescue operation involving dozens of emergency crews is underway. 27 survivors have been taken to hospital, many of them seriously injured. Now, at this stage, it is still unclear what went so horribly wrong, but it looks likely to become one of Europe's worst airline accidents. Tim Rogers has the latest. This was the scale of the response. Every ambulance and emergency vehicle...